Hi, this is Chidam. I'm a researcher in Italian Institute of Technology. In this video, I'm going to introduce you our work, SVWAT Visual Voice Activity Detection by Motion Segmentation. Voice Activity Detection shortly what answers the question who is speaking and when. The traditional way to perform what is based on audio signal processing. Audio-based VAT systems are challenged by the presence of ambient noise and they are sensitive to noise variations. Moreover, they might suffer from complications occurring when there is overlapping speech. Recently, multimodal VAT methods become attractive due to their more accurate performances. However, multimodal VAT might not be applicable when the audio data is not available. In such cases, the use of information from vision modality only, so-called visual VAT, is very desirable. In this study, we present a novel visual voice activity detection method named SVWAT. SVWAT operates directly on the entire video frame without the explicit need of detecting a person or his or body parts. It learns body motion cues associated with speech activity within a weakly supervised segmentation framework. SVWAT not only detects the speakers or not speakers, but simultaneously localizes the image positions of them. SVWAT is end-to-end, person-independent and generic. Therefore, it can be applied to any person without retraining. SVWAT doesn't require any prior knowledge nor preprocessing. In training, we adapt dynamic image representation which summarizes the short-term spatial-temporal content of a video segment. One dynamic image is obtained from 10 consecutive RGB frames without overlapping. The resulting image is then cropped into sub-dynamic images, each contains a single subject. Multiple sub-dynamic images with speaking or not speaking labels are used to fine-tune a ResNet 50. The fine-tuned ResNet is used to obtain class activation maps, which are further used for the training of a fully convolutional network performing segmentation. For class activation map-based mask generation, we adapted GradCam method. For speaking class activation map, we keep the pixels, which intersect with the pixels belonging to the speaking persons in the ground route. The same procedure is applied during the creation of non-speaking class activation map. A mask is obtained by using class activation maps such that speaking pixels are multiplied by 255 and not speaking pixels are multiplied by 127. A mask can have pixels having up to three semantics, speaking, not speaking and background. Finally, the trained ResNet 50 is also integrated to fully convolutional network architecture. This architecture produces three channels having the meanings speaking, not speaking and background, which is called pixel-wise prediction. At test time, first a single dynamic image is constructed from 10 consecutive RGB frames. Using the trained fully convolutional network, that dynamic image is segmented such that pixel-wise prediction having three channels, background, speaking and not speaking, is obtained. These predictions are merged into a single image as applied for mask generation and the resulting image is called as final prediction. The size of final prediction image is the same with the input dynamic image and it contains pixels having one of the upper mentioned three semantics. The location of speaking pixels and not speaking pixels are clustered individually using affinity propagation algorithm. For each cluster, recall that each cluster is either speaking or not speaking, we find a bounding box which tightly surrounds it. Finally, the location of bounding boxes are projected onto the 10 RGB frames with the predicted voice activity labels. SVWAT was tested using publicly available datasets constructed from real-world situations. The experimental analysis showed that SVWAT outperforms all the state-of-the-art visual and multimodal VAT approaches on average. SVWAT generalizes well, resulting similar performance independent to the test person. Performed ablation studies show that each component of SVWAT has a positive contribution. Cross dataset analysis show that SVWAT generalized well and its performance is as good as the same dataset analysis. SVWAT is the first attempt at visual voice activity detection is performed by body motion cues learning with weak supervised segmentation. SVWAT demonstrates better results than the state of the art on multiple dataset as well as surpassing the multimodal state of the art methods. The better generalization capability of SVWAT is confirmed for cross dataset and person independent scenarios. The code of the SVWAT can be reached by scanning the QR code given in this slide or by visiting IIT Pavis GitHub page. Thank you for your attendance.